like to lay one back this way. What do you got? Those aren't doing anything, Alan. 1942 WLC bent. Maybe. Now, can you tell it's bent? Let me see here. Let's see if we can get it. Oh. What are you putting that out there? Get yes, that I thought I'd get a straight line on it. Get that. Uh, I'm not leaning over here. But it looks to me. I'm going off the flat surface that I care about. It's leaning to the right. Yeah, but a lot of it's in the back there. A lot of it's in that stand. Because when you kick started it, the stand was like. We a know piece the back of, of the motor mount. Is this, we know this stuff here is all screwed up right here. The stand's definitely not true, and this bent through here. But what we're looking right now is all of the rods. If they look like they're all identical well, everywhere we put a rod, which they all look like they're at the same angle if you look at them. This one here fell. This one's a little off. Yeah, it's not, so it's not twisted. So it's all to the right. So everything in front of the axle, it looks like it's parallel to each other. All the rods are straight. So let me see it. So it's not like twisting on it. So all of these rods, if you look at it, if you go up and down at angles, you can see the rods all line up. Yeah, you can look at both sides of rods. Bad. See when two rods line up with each other by going up like this, you can actually see parallelism pretty easy. That light's kind of hurting us a little bit. Not too bad there. for a 70 year old bike. 75. 75 year old bike. Let's get rid of that one light. <laughs> no shit. So they are beating the crap out of this thing. Yeah, definitely. So there's your rods up there. So if you come down. You look at all those rods, and you can see it. Every one of those rods lines up pretty damn good. There's one right there. So all those rods are good. And if the neck was bent over, the rods would be leaning a little right. bit, but they're not. So even you look at those, see now you don't have the light. Yeah, you can see the rods. See when you go up, uh -huh. see how the lights they line up with each other. See right there, they lined up two line up, and that's two foot apart. <laughs> you get down here, you can see it again. Well, ain't too bad. Not so, bad. <clears throat> well, every, so what do you think, Alan? I like it. I'm you happy? happy about that. What about Mario? Uh, yeah, it's bad. What about, <laughs> oh my God, it's a pile of crap on the floor. Every, every time I get down on this thing, he brings out the pictures of that army bike that they found in a building. Yeah. And I mean, it's ugly. That was a this building? That was a, a chicken coop. Well, this thing was not near as ugly. That was as on that a Montana was. ranch in a oh, chicken coop. Man. And it was in that chicken coop for like 20 years. Oh, so it was, it was about two inches thick of goo. Horrible. So, but anyway, all these angles you look at, you know, they all look fairly parallel. Every view you look at here. No, you're right. You Everything is it. straight. It just looks like probably it's probably the, the rear side. Now we don't have no fancy lasers here. We only have gravity. But and for as sense. jacked up as everything else on this and common bike sense was, goes a long ways. But we do have a lot of work to do back here in yeah. the axle place because these yeah. things are bent all the hell back bent here. Hell. Yeah. And this rear stand that you got is definitely not straight. It's about as straight as that fork was up there. Yeah, and the fork's straight now. Yeah, this one's straight now, but it wasn't before. Now you look at it from this angle, and you see all the rods just look nice and true with each Not other. Bad. They're parallel. Not bad. For what we're building here. What are we building here? I mean, we're not powder coating nothing. We're building we're a race vehicle here. The race street race. Uh, see, see, if he gets are? his way, see, he's already got a stroker motor out. We're building a stroker <laughs> motor, <laughs> and we're, we're, <laughs> get out of here. Hey, Troy. You're a real character, man. Well, you but you know what, though? He comes alive when he's working on 45 stuff. I, he yeah. really does. <laughs> and if we could get to this... No, you're not an Indian buff. No, I can no. tell you that. No, no, no. And that's a beauty, too. <clears throat> that's a lot of your personality in that thing there. That or so. that's yeah. There it is. Look at that thing. My goal yeah. is to get your military bikes lined up side by side and start hanging parts on them. That would really be fun. Oh. Have you been up in his garage at his house? I have. Oh man, where he's got all that stuff oh. up there. We're gonna need some help getting him down out of there, but. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah. All bikes on the second floor and third yeah. floor? Yeah, oh. that's, uh, that's. I haven't been up there. You haven't? No. Well, he'll take you up there. I've been in the, bla I've been in the blasting booth. I see your seat post tube is multiple angles, but that's how it's made probably. 
Okay, <laughs> how are we going to get that bushing out of the C post? This, this custom, you have to take pictures, you can't see it from over there. Well, I'm just saying, you can't get a lip here. I saw your little puller. You thought we might have to cut it. Let me get these out of your way so you don't poke okay. yourself. That's brass. We got a new seat post, which was frightfully expensive. But less than what I sell them for on eBay. Yeah, that's true. And I'm, I'm satisfied. I'm not complaining. Not like Walker. See, who else would buy a seat post for you to save from no. buying it from me? Well, nobody. Just you. He had and it in stock. No, no he did not. We, we went no, we, one. no, we watched for it on eBay, and one came up, and he purchased it, and it's new old stock. It's and still greasy. And it was at home cleaning up from the flood in the shop. There was a box of 40 of them still sitting there. Oh, yeah, but you want 500 a piece for them. That's mom's money. That's okay. Mom's paid her dues. <laughs> because dad died, he didn't get the money. Now mom's getting it. So it's her retirement money. That's okay. Well, I don't get any money. That's what it's here. about. Also, this is stripped here. I don't know if you noticed that. This is some special Harley thread in here. No, there isn't. There's no hole there. It's just a hole. All right. Well, this goes through to tension the transmission. No. Where does that? Through here, then? That slot right there. Oh, okay. It's, that's not rusty, unlike every other five, every frame you see. This groove right here is where the transmission adjuster goes in to adjust your training. All right. It's got some goop in there that you need to clean out. All right. Show them the bottom of this, too. This is somebody goofed this up on the bottom. Turn this over. Stand it up. Oh, well, that's need to be worked on. Yeah. Yeah, somebody, somebody uh, hog wallered that out. That's supposed to be an oval hole, and that's not oval anymore. An oval hole? Yeah, for the seat post. Right now, the whole seat post would fall right through just about. Somebody fixed it. This does not look like it's but, even been sandblasted, does it? No, it's still got brass on it. Well, brass doesn't go away from sand. No, but I'm just saying. But this looks like, uh, unlike the rest of your bike paint, it looks more original. But yeah. anyway, all your slots are good through here. So. Hard to tell. So the frame is pretty damn nice. There's no rust on it at all, which is really nice. You know, actually, you set your bike with a pile of crap. I did. Well, there were a lot of piles of crap on it. There was a lot of good stuff on this bike. There's a lot of crap on it, like this front end was crap until we fixed it, but it was still original. So. Yeah, and tell them about really. the frames, too. No numbers on the military frames. No military, no numbers on any Harley frame. There's a, there's a number right here, cast a 3E. Casting numbers. Let me move a light, you're killing me. There's casting numbers on all original frames back here on the axle plates. Well, right. isn't there supposed to be some type of number along that top this bend? This is the foundry there? mark, and this is your, your this is the uh, pattern number. That These are jacked up too. The I, new colony adjusters will not go through yeah, there. Somebody uh, stripped the holes out. We got yep. to call these. Okay. Well, we've got some work to do on this frame, but at least it's not bent like I thought it was. So. Wow. What does MF mean? Mother. I could tell you, but it'd be a secret. No. The mother of all. <laughs> 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 what was that, Fred? I mean, not Fred. What was that? Was <laughs> the mother of all frames, yeah. ML. Yeah. I don't even get to use my frame table now. I know, we don't need it. See, you spent thousands of dollars on that frame table. Yeah, I got my frame oh, table well. under here. No, we'll I can't pass use it. We'll pass it on to the next guy. No, I'm happy with that. Oh, there's a panhead under that bark. What year? 54. X police looks, panhead. Look stock. Look at that. It's nice. It's it's almost virgin you stock. Seen that it's I nice. have. It's nice. Might as well put like make it a monument and it won't leave that lift. You know Never. I mean? Never. Start, I'll start bringing candles over, some flowers and stuff, and make it a monument. The little Madonna yeah. and the blowing yeah. glass. <laughs> Alan, pick up a little bit of the cover. They can't see anything. I mean, this thing isn't left. There's a Harley under there somewhere. Oh, it's nice. Oh, yeah, it's really there's nice. actually a Harley under look there. Look at the someplace. stand. Nice. Now that one's straight because I fixed all of that. Look at that. that. Everything on that bike fits because it's been fixed already. I like the cylinders on this bike, sil silver. Yeah. It really gives it a like a like a uh, like a prototype look or something. Looks look at like the a cases. Harley. It's nice. Yeah. Well, sometime this year that one's going to get finished because it's it's ready to. I get the motor all fixed up again. I just got to pretty much just start it. Well, it was the uh, oil pump that was tied in it, wasn't it? Uh, the oil pump was tied, but the uh, the left-hand main seal that was custom-made was made wrong. And the motor pretty tight enough, so we had to fix all that. Looks so, good sitting up like oh well. that. Seriously. All right, enough fun. We can't work on any more good stuff. we got to go work on Mario's ah! shovel head motor now. So that's real... Real stuff. Yeah, right that's enough crap. We, got, we can't, we can't, we can't lose this guy no more. I can't afford 